Today I'm excited to share some incredibly cool and affordable products for your Apple devices, all priced under $100. Some of these accessories are so unique and innovative that I'm confident that they will catch your interest. I've personally never encountered anything like them before. And this selection of recommendations is brought to you by today's video partner, Basis. Starting off, this is a very unique, ultra thin power bank known as the Blade 2. It's the slimmest power bank I've ever used at only 7.3 millimeters and it fits like a glove in any backpack without taking too much space, which makes it perfect for travel. To put this into perspective for you, it's as thin as my iPhone 15 Pro Max, which is incredible. It's extremely light as well at only 323 grams of weight, and it just looks and feels so premium to hold. It also has a display on the front of the device to show you the percentage remaining on the Blade 2, as well as the current voltage and amps being outputted between both USB-C ports, which is actually really cool. This type of detail further extends into their app as the Blade 2 does support Bluetooth. So you'll be able to see info on your phone regarding its temperature and battery level. You can customize the display to be different backgrounds, and it even has the ability to create a custom screensaver to personalize the device more, which in my case, I had my name come up because I just think it's kind of cool. It also has a data tab to show you the live data regarding the power, current, and voltage for each Type-C port when in use. As for its capacity, it comes with 12,000 milliamp hours with support for 65 watt charging through both of the USB-C ports, which is the perfect amount of juice for charging your MacBook, iPad, iPhone, AirPods, the entire Apple ecosystem. For more perspective, you can charge your iPhone roughly 2.2 times on this device, or your AirPods Pro roughly 40 charges. Bezos says while devices are connected, this power bank is able to provide smarter charging with automatic power allocation, resulting in a safer, more efficient charge with less power loss. It's also rated for over 20,000 cycles, so you can feel confident that this power bank will last you years without losing or degrading from its original battery capacity. Where things start to get really interesting is with this 25 watt Mag Pro 2-in-1 wireless charger, I've actually never owned something quite like this before, so let me explain. It's a small black cube where if you push on the bottom, it opens up to a retractable USB-C cord, which is super clutch as you never have to worry about bringing an extra cord with you like other multi-device chargers. You prop open the top to allow charge of up to 15 watts for your iPhone, up to five watts for your AirPods on the back, and five watts for your Apple Watch if you plug it into the side of the available USB-C port. Keep in mind, it actually doesn't come with this USB-C Apple Watch charger, so that is something you would need to actually get separately. And there it is. That's the complete setup. It is super compact and it will be something that will live in my travel bag for a very long time. And speaking of compact, take a look at this. This is Bezos's 100 watt retractable USB-C cord that supports fast charging. I absolutely love this thing and it's not just because it's super fun to retract in and out or the fact that it comes in a variety of beautiful colors to choose from that match your personality and lifestyle, but it's also because it makes cable management just so easy. It fits like a glove in any bag without having your cords tangle into anything as they're always retracted. It can honestly even fit in your pocket because it's that thin. And even even better, when you are using it for charge, you aren't bound to the cable length you bought, keeping your workspace and charging area clutter free. And because it supports 100 watts, this cable is not just good for your phone, it's great for fast charging your MacBook Pro and other large devices that support high wattage charging when paired with the appropriate power brick. And this thing is rated for 50,000 pulling cycles, so you can feel confident that it will last a long time retracting in and out without breaking. Okay, so as for this next product that I'm about to show you, it is a lot more useful than it appears, and you have to hear me out on this. This is the Basis Magnetic Power Bank, which comes in a variety of really fun colors that supports 15 watt MagSafe charging for your iPhone, but where it starts to get really interesting is that it also has a built-in USB-C cord that you can plug into your iPhone as an alternative for faster 30 watt charging in the event of an emergency, or you just simply really want to charge your phone fast right away. I love that because all other MagSafe power banks don't offer an alternative for faster charging. So I really appreciate that you get a choice here on what charging speed that you want. And I think we can all relate to just desperately needing to charge our phone fast. As of 2024, wireless charging on iPhone is good, but it's not anywhere near as fast as wired charging. So when you think about it, it's a really great backup solution built into this product 
And for anyone wondering, yes, I did test this, but no, you can't wire charge and wireless charge at the same time. So the orange indicator shows that it's on a wireless charge. And then if you plug your iPhone into the USB-C cable, the orange icon will go away to indicate that it's now giving a wired charge. So you can't do both. In the event that you do opt for the wireless charge option, you can plug this cable back into the available USB-C port above, and it creates a simple ring to hold everything together, which I think is really cool. And it does have an additional USB-C port that allows you to charge an additional device at the same time. But let's switch gears for a second. There were some tech products in the last 12 months that were just complete flops for me, accessories that didn't quite work out the way that I intended. And I discussed this in a video where I shared my tech favorites and tech flops for 2023. You guys are gonna love that video, so click right here to watch it now. 